What's up, y'all? Twan Eagles 215 Report back at y'all with another video. If you're new to the channel, guys, go ahead and smash the subscribe button. I'm on the road to 1K. I would greatly appreciate if y'all help me out. Also, guys, smash the thumbs up button for me. Leave your comments down below to let me know what you think. Now, let's get right into it. Now, I have some news. It's not good news. It's bad news. The bad news is, of course, as we've known, if you haven't heard by now, our guy, one of our pivotal pieces, our pro bowler, Brandon Brooks, offensive lineman, has torn his Achilles. Now, that's not good at all for us. Um, I mean, it sucks. The injury bug continuously hits us all the time. The injury bug hits us uh, year after year after year. I think now we're, I guess, maybe just getting used to playing, you know, as far as injuries go, just basically getting hurt. You know, somebody's always getting hurt, you know. How we got hurt, I, I don't know yet. It hasn't been um, said, but he did have, I think, on his Instagram a few days ago, he was kickboxing and kickboxing with a, uh, a trainer and a pad. So with that being said, I don't know what happened between those, but... That's that's that, and we have to find someone to fill a hole. That's a big piece to be missing. Um, he stands like next to Lane Johnson. Of course, Lane, him and Lane Johnson are very good friends. So, um, what we have to deal with on this roster is, I think, Jack Dorsal, um, Prince Tega. The the these are the two uh, uh, guys we got in the draft. Guys, we got in the draft. Uh, Nate, we got Julio, Good P Good Jones, and it's still got Isaac Samalu, which he's not bad at all. He's actually okay, but you know he's he's a, he's a great like guy to um, basically when a run is coming and it's like a pitch. He's a quick guy to kind of, you know, a quick swing guy. He can break out real fast and start pushing people out the way. Um, standing up, holding pass protection, um, he's not the best. I would say that's more of one of Isaac uh, Salafalu's weakest points. But, you know, if that's who we have to go with, um, then maybe, yeah. Um, there's a few other options. Um, free agency still going on. Maybe we could get a replacement. Um, hopefully we can get somebody that's, you know, pretty solid if we have to find that person, you know, because that is, like I said, that's a very important position. And, you know, we don't need nobody, you know, that's going to give up a lot of sacks and not going to basically stand their ground because, with that being said, we know that Carson Wentz will be getting sacked a lot. And that's what we don't want. We don't want Carson Wentz to get hit. We don't want him to get sacked. So, we have to find the best option. Um, like I said, we can look within. Um, we could do a lot of different things. Now, um, basically, Doug Peterson got the news. And um, when Doug got it, he basically said, you know, his heart sunk. You know, um, about the Brandon Brooks thing, you know, and, you know, he said, I think they want to explore within first, you know, and, you know, see what guys they can got. Now, they also got, uh, I think, Jordan Mulata or something like that. So you got them guys and, um, you know, his heart sunk and he was very, you know, devastated, you know, and like I said, that hurts. Now, Brandon Brooks had dealt with, uh, that depression, things of that nature, if y'all can remember. And um, the locker room came together, rallied together for him, you know, and uh, they basically, his office and locker room just was there for him at that point in time. But, you know, like I said, bringing, getting a replacement for him, I don't know. He's one of the best guards in the league, if not the best. Um, it's going to be a tough one, guys. So, you know, we're going to have to figure something out. we got to figure something out. we got to do a, 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 a plug and pull, plug and play, something like that. And we're going to have to get somebody there to at least be 50 to 75% of what Brandon Brooks was. That, that would be my guess. 
Also, guys, a little update. Um, you know, Alshon Jeffrey, we got that thing going on. And basically with him, we have um, a thing of the matter of Alshon just basically trying. Doug spoke on it. And, you know, he said he just want him to be able to return. He need to focus on his rehab and that, you know, he will be a part of the plan when he comes back. So, you know, and, you know, a lot of us, I think, want Alshon gone. So, you know, he won't be here as far as starting the season. So we'll see when he comes back, whenever he's ready from his injury. And that's all I have to say about that. If you made it this far in this video, I greatly appreciate it. It's Twan Eagles 215, and I'm signing out, and as always, fly, Eagles, fly.